Hello again, everyone. It is your Black Knight. And I've got the sound of the game turned way down because I'm in golf voice mode. In golf voice announcer mode. Oh, look, he's at the third tee and he's trying to hit it with a swizzle stick. Um, just because it's, it's not quite 8 o'clock in the morning on a Saturday. Shut up, Lester. And... I'm just back. This is my first day back. Just landed yesterday from a, a long business trip. Where the only GTA I've had has been through my my older laptop. Which will let you at least spin the wheel. Do a couple minor things, but not like a lot. I'm gonna go to the garage. And so there are a couple of videos I've been planning for this last two weeks, just as a point of escape in my own mind, just to keep me going until I got home. But uh, one of the things I did do while I was away, because yeah, I didn't want to miss the sale, is I picked up this car over here. Do 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 do. Get in the car. How are we not getting in the car? I want to get in the car. Do I not know how to get in the car anymore? The Zoroso, the Picasso Zoroso. He's so beautiful. It's not exactly what I need for what I'm trying to do. But what we're going to do is we're going to make this an homage to Tyler Hoover's. Um, is his Mercilago. It's not exactly the right shape, but it's close enough. It's the only, it's the only, uh, speedster in the Pegasi live. I can't find another Lamborghini that matches. Now, the reason we're going to do this is we now have two more properties we can get. So I can now, now despite the fact that I now have no spaces, there might be a space over in the casino because I moved that one or the other. There's one, one space in the casino. I have one space. So I need more parking. And by the way, uh, that over here, this has accidentally hit the point button. I, didn't, I never know what the point button is. There it is. This one over here where I'm pointing, that's not real effective. But that, I picked up, you can get it at Simeon's. And it's a dubstep, but it does appear to be a dubstep too. Now, this character didn't have a dubstep 2, so I bought that immediately while I was away, too, just so I didn't lose out on the possibility of getting one, because this allows you to spawn dubstep 2s. We're going to try that in another video. That's going to... We're going to see if it actually works. If it's a dubstep 2, if it's a regular dubstep... But he's got the offset wheel. So, I mean, offset spare tire. So it should be a 2. So we're going to modify this up at some point. But the first thing we're going to do is we are going to buy. And let's look for this together now. Dynasty 8. View property listings. High end. So we're going to buy the cheapest stilt apartment available. The cheapest stilt apartment that you can buy in GTA Online. And it looks like it's this one. You might say, oh no, we, we got more. We just keep going down. 4, 470, 478, 449. And now we're down to the older properties, I think. Yeah. Let's just. Now there's a reason we're going to do this. And not just because I'm being cheap. We could get cheaper stuff. I mean, we could really go all the way down. And get like a 10, you know, get go to South Shamble Street and get a $105,000 place. That would be the smart way to go. But I don't have any still departments. I've decided I'm going to get two. All right, so this is it. Mad Wayne Thunder Drive. That sounds perfect. Because what we're going to do is we're going to make this the home of our Tyler Hoover, Hoover's Garage Collection. That's right. We're gonna, for 400, for now, we've, we've already built our way up to 
to somewhere in the middle range here of 100, anyway, 118 million, 200,000. So this really the money doesn't matter. We're, we're good, but we're going to buy this one. Get the directions. And then you buy. why does it just let you just do, come on. We've got directions in the map now, but we're going to buy it anyway. So you property listing, blah, 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 blah. the cheapest, stealth apartment. So we're gonna get the dragger at some point, but or dragger, yeah, I don't know. So stilt apartment by purchase property. And we go down here. Why is there only one empty? We're supposed to get two. Ooh, this is disturbing to me. Because I want to get two properties. And there's one property I definitely want in this character. That's the most expensive one. So let's 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 let us let us cancel that. All right. Okay. This is going to become more of a hybrid thing. Now this still apartment here with the pool. If we look at that, it should I believe that's the one we wanted. Let's get directions to that one. Return to map. We're going to drive there first. We're going to make sure we've got the right one. The Wild Oats Drive. That's the one I want for my per my own personal collection. But uh, I've got I've got a personal collection I want to put together there. It's going to be my my main stilt house. This is taking a turn. I don't know why I only have access to one. Maybe you get another access to another empty once you've bought one. We're gonna modify this up first. In fact, I'm gonna grab my phone, pull up. That's not in game. Yeah, both them. Let me Google Tyler Hoover. I'll try to put this up. This is gonna be a, an edited one. Tyler Hoover Mercy. I don't know how to spell Mercy Lago, if I'm really honest. There, you go. there we go. Okay, so I've got some images here. Let us download that image. Maybe we'll put that up. It's from the Hoobies Garage Wiki, so that's got to be something we can we can work with, right? Maybe I'll have to put a link in the description or something like that. Not a lot. Okay, so it's a one-tone look. We're, we're pretty close as far as the actual color. And really, even the wheels. It's a, it's a pretty... It'd be nice if we could change to like a, a wilder color interior. But let's rev it up. This is, we want this to be raceable. <laughs> the body style is not as smooth as a uh, as a mercy now we're not, do, we're not doing a, a, a freddy a, you know a freddy build here let's leave the stock for right now not doing a Tavares build front bumpers okay so here we can i can i'll throw this up in a corner someplace here we can look at this how can we this isn't really a bad bad an analogy here for this. If we go with that, that makes it open. Looks closer. Open two. No, not so much open two. We might want to take change that to like a, a secondary. If the secondary is black, we might want to change that up. I definitely open. That's as close as we're going to get. And if I can make that, if I can take the black away when we get to the repaint. Stock grill capped open that's pretty subtle it's just how it's breathing we want capped for for what we're doing hood stock hood clean streamline if we're looking at his hood it's a clean hood so clean hood again this is an homage it's not going to be close Horn. 
We'll give it to San Andreas. I don't know. Let's see. What would be the... What's the best thing for a guy from Kansas? Probably let's just Stockhorn. Let's leave that as it is. Lights, we need We need uh, a neon kit. Layout, front, back, sides. Um, I think, obviously, we'll do this orange. You need that just so it lowers the uh, center of gravity a little bit. Livery, we're not doing one, but we'll, we'll go through them just to show you them. Just to keep it interesting. Yeah, no livery. The respray. Now, primary color, it's already orange. It's already pretty close, but I do get a hint of a pearlescent off this. I mean, it seems like it's 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 orange with a bright orange pearlescent in most of the photos I look at. Oh, that does look... See, there's so many different ways of making this look good. Definitely that orange. With the gold for less than, now that's not that's pretty close actually. Wow. Yeah, that's that's kind of there. <coughs> Does it look more like the the bright orange might be better though? That might be closer. Yeah, we're gonna go bright orange. So now, what gets affected by the secondary? Not what I wanted. So we're just gonna we're just gonna keep that as an orange pearlescent. And the carbon accents, which aren't on Hoobies, are just gonna have to be there. It's just how it is. We might have some roof for leaving. Spoiler, we need a spoiler, but which I don't think his has. Now, if we're gonna go if we're gonna be pure about this. Now this Rosso I think might have an active spoiler, does it not? It looks like it does. Yeah, that none of that really works. Let's leave let's see if it has the active spoiler. That the active actually is a little bit less ideal because you don't get the effect at really low speed, but you know, this isn't primarily going to be a racer anyway. We probably will race it just to. Turbo, obviously. Wheels. Now, is there anything here in the high end range? I think so. You know, it, it, it strikes me. Wheel type. Those are probably alloy, not chrome, but. Yeah, let's see. Let's see. The high end stock rims. No, no, no. That's, well, that's not too far. That's not bad, but it's a little bit too much. There's a specific one I'm thinking of. That kind of, that kind of works. GT Chrome kind of works. <coughs> Okay, it's not in high end. Maybe it's in track. No, that was no. That no, it's it's just almost kind of a looks like wrenches kind of. That that isn't too far, but no. It's amazing how you can get such specific wheels. Streakers? These are almost a little too thick. There we go. A little bit thinner. That's not it. Yeah, you look at so many wheels. You think you just know where the heck everything is. And I doubt. Tuner. Oh, I know there's a pair of wheels like this. I can see them. SUV. That's kind of close. That's kind. Those are the ones I was kind of thinking of, which has kind of the effect. There's a little bit too many spokes, 
and you know the edges are a little bit too eh. see that's kind of close to what I'm looking for but not it's that's the one I was thinking of but it's not it's a little too squared off oh, boogers okay let's uh go back to high end we're gonna change it I don't know you know what maybe after all that you lose that you lose the orange stripe around there which he doesn't have on his anyway That's pretty close. The blade is pretty close. There's one other that, that worked pretty well. I think that one. That, yeah, I think GT Chrome, we're going with it. Which I didn't get Chrome ones, I don't think, but again, his little catalog. So we'll, we'll go with that for right now. And who knows, maybe those are Chrome. Uh, we'll color. Oh, you can change these, but only on the. Ooh, there you go. So you could get. They are chrome. You can do like an inset here. Hmm. Well, we can match it up that way. I mean, that's not accurate if I'm perfectly honest does it look better than just stock let's leave look, this is more of the homage let's let's go with that we can always change it later windows get a light smoke no matter what I'm doing and that's pretty much oh we, we only missed under wheels tires uh, tire design I don't think we want to go customs on this but what we do want are bulletproof tires and Orange star smoke. It's just totally orange. We're going to exit with this car. We're going to go for room. EGDLP, I'm not dealing with you today. Okay, we've already got a map. Does this have an active spoiler or is it just cracked? It needs. Okay, we're going to have to put a lip on this. See, the traffic's not been fixed. New items are available in the clothing store. Apparently, if we get by the uh, the new off-roader, which we will at some point, there'll be a video for that. These these I've been over this before. This these purchasing videos are really just excuse me. These are just things that I do that I can enjoy myself at some point when. I'm, no longer able to play the game, but I can remember what I had in the game. It's for sentimentality and for posterity. And before I buy this, I just want to make sure it's the one with the pool, because that was one of the, one of the things I wanted. The rest of it feels pretty good, always has. Whee. And now you're seeing why I never really bought any of the stilt houses. They're tricky to get to. And not if you're driving the uh, the Deluxo, but I mean, you know, cool. Excuse me, as I bump you, as I beep your nose. Okay, for sale. And that's a ten-car garage. Yeah, I know. It seems silly, doesn't it? But I guess we're dealing with depth here. Yep, it's the one to pull. Okay. So. We're going to make this ours. And I, again, I have plans for what cars I want to put in here. So this is the best still house you can possibly get. And I think the only one with a pool. Purchase property. Empty. Now, if if I don't get another another option to another empty apartment, number one, there's something wrong. So we go down to the cheapest still apartment. That's four four nine, right? Because that's, that's that's Tyler's meme. He, that's always the cheapest or whatever it was that you could get, and that's why it's so wonderful. Buy, purchase property. Ah, there is another empty. Okay, so we could we'll work with this this other 
wild oats drive. Almost like you lose half your value on it. We'll deal with that later. Let's return to map. Um, let's let's get this on the map. So we have purchased the uh, the cheapest stilt house you can get. I don't think we can get on the map. We have to look at our map and go. Okay, out, 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 out. Get, 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 get. Let's get back out to the car. This place is now main. And yep, the for sale sign is gone. Which means there's a slight variation. And look at this, we're neighbors. Isn't that useful? Uh, let's see, where's the uh, where's the other one? Uh, that's another one you can buy. This is Where's my other silk house? It says owned apartment, but it's a silk house. That, where is that? Might be the apartment. Where's my um? I have no idea why I just bought. Okay, that's that's definitely these are the two apartments. That's got to be my other silk house. Okay, so we're not as close as we thought. <coughs> So I had to get the cheapest stilt house for my Hoovies Garage collection because that would be, you know, the way Hoovie would go with it. Not that his own house is that. Is that have you ever seen Hoovie's house? Obviously, if you watched any of the videos, you have. That thing is just magnificent. Not he's never really given us an in-house tour. Like, you know, what's Hoobie's bedroom look like? Which I guess that's not really his prerogative, so it's, I wouldn't do that. But he's certainly not in the, the in the current day and age. Why, why would he give somebody like you know a map to his house to where the valuables are? You know, it's not something you'd do. It's not a good security thing. Beautiful house though. But he would because I'm doing this the way he would buy his cars. Okay, and we're gonna pull this in. Look at this tiny little, just barely fits the car in. And suddenly, lots of space. Isn't it magnificent? Now, this is one of the, the, the older style garages where you had a lot of light. So you can really see well what we've got here. Oh, I've got sunglasses on because it's, of course, you know. They're still running all those same bonuses. That's interesting. It's an interesting, interesting thing. So we're going to have to put a lip spoiler on this, but at least it's home. We could take that out and do something else with it in a minute, but let's get the other cars in. I only have a few that are specific to Hoovy, but then, you know, there's going to be a very Hoovy thing I do here. So, first of all, thank goodness they have reduced the time that it takes you to get a car. And the, you know, a while back reduced the the cooldown. You need something, huh? When you so arrive, let's see. We should be know. in the agency garage. Early, early, earlier. Banshee topless. Tory, 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 Ignis. Let's see. Was it the 770 that I got? That was. The, was this the one? No, that's the green one. Where did I put? the champion. Okay, I think we're going to do the time warp again. Ah, here we go. It was in Office 3. Obviously, the, the used to be the combined Top Gear movies, right? But we're, 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 we're breaking this out because there, there's the theme. So, so here's my Masakro, which... Uh, is an homage to the Aston Martin that was owned by Ed Bullion and Fred Tavares Hernandez and now is owned by Tyler Hoover. So we're bringing that in. So that gives me a space over in Garage, you know, Office Garage 3. It should also have This might be a bit quick for the cooldown, even for the new cooldown. What you need, boss? Some wheels? So I can bring around. Move from Office Garage Three. 
the super diamond. Yay. 48 seconds. We can wait 48 seconds together, I think. The super diamond is, of course, my homage to his purple Rolls Royce, which he has sold off a long time ago, but I love the purple Rolls Royce. How can you not love a purple Rolls Royce? It's just such a not British way of having a Rolls Royce. Boy, 48 seconds is longer than you think. Now, if you think I've just bought a, a garage for three cars, then that seems awfully silly, and that would be silly, but that's not all I've got planned for this one. You see, he also has, I, he also has a, a Countach, a white Countach, and I have a white Countach, so that would fit here, but I made a specific point of getting the three Countaches of, of note. You know, the white Countach is significant because it was in Cannonball 2, uh, GTA Vice City. And I built a model of it as a kid. You know, white was my choice uh, of, uh, of spray painting my Lambo model. But then you got the red Countach, which was the white Countach from, from Cannonball 2. That they basically hosed off all the fake white paint in, the, in that opening scene. You've got the red Countach from Speed Zone or Cannonball 3, if you want to look at it that way. I'll get there as soon as I can. I think I may have done it up more like the Cannonball 3 one, but I'm not really sure. And, of course, the black Lamborghini from Cannonball 1. So I, I, keep, I want to keep all three of those together, which would be a very, very Hoover thing to do. So they're all coming here, too. And so me, what we'll do is we'll, we'll park the purple... And then we'll go, we'll do the time warp again while I move some Lambos. Some regular glasses here so that we can, we go first person, it's not changing the look all that much. But as you can see, we have now the complete Torero collection, including the one that's similar to the one that Hoovy had. Got the Zeroso. We also dragged over my Infernus Classic, which... Does not look like the gray one, the gray Diablo that he had. But this was a one that I won off the wheel. And my tendency when I win them off the wheel is to leave them look as much as possible to the way I won them off the wheel. So you can recognize it as a car that was won off the wheel. And pink, that's a way I'll remember that. I don't generally go with pink. So this is one of my few pink cars. And I'm sure, I'm sure Toby's daughter would appreciate it. So there you go. This is, this is for her. And I've brought up... My Sterling GT, which we're going to do some work on this, because now there's a whole bunch more liveries available. You don't necessarily... I didn't want to get into it. What are we doing? No, I didn't want to get... No, stop. What are you doing? Stop it. Uh, you, you don't necessarily have to have the tire anymore as a spoiler, and there's a whole bunch of liveries. And um, I had... This, this actually could go in either garage, because I did have a... Uh, I still have someplace. You know, a 300... SL that uh, had all kinds of ra had racing livery on it. So we're gonna try and make that as close to my, my old. It was a, it was a it wasn't a matchbox. It was a full size diecast car that I still have. I think it's on a shelf over here with my transformers. But we got that. Need the wheel. We've got this one that we brought up. Here's the purple. The the you know, the the grape ape. The grape ape uh, Rolls Royce here. The Windsor drop. But I think I think this is where we're gonna hold. Yo, you know, there's one thing, more thing we're gonna do. We're gonna, we're gonna be done with cars for a little while. We're coming back to you. But for right now, just to wrap this video up, there's no doorway. We can't. There's no way to get directly into the house. We have to go out. Okay. Two doors become one door again. It's 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 just physically impossible. But you gotta love GTA. There's so much that's physically impossible. You just gotta embrace it. So how does the house look? It looks very nicely appointed. I can't remember. Is there a way of redecorating? That was, I think, on some of the higher-end apartments, but I don't think you could do it here. So we're, this is what we, we've got. What we've got. I mean, there, we can have a nice glass of wine. Um, there is green juice, so we can we can get our health back. 
the view can we can just spy on the neighbors. Ooh, they have a hot tub. Actually, it looks pretty close to my hot tub, so that's that's nice. I'm like closer to the house, but you know, hey. Uh, we could do inappropriate things. You have the option. We have a TV. We have a spyglass. And how good is the spyglass? We have a spell, I guess, really, literally, for looking at stars. We could do that. That's have the telescope. Eat eggs. We're not going to spy on anybody. Can we go out on the porch? Okay, I want to. Go, I want to go out on the porch. Okay, that's annoying. There's no door. There's literally no way to get out here. Rockstar? Rockstar? I can't even get out on my own porch. Okay, we can go downstairs. Do -do -do. You have a couple levels here. First of all... Ooh, living, here's the bedroom. Show sure we can go out on this porch. Seriously? Okay, change of clothes. El Cuatro de Baño. And the shower, so we can rinse off all the blood. Go back out. And it's just, it's just a, a place to sit. Declarations. Oh, here's your playing room. Okay. So we got a planning room, but there's no way of going outside without. Is that for safety? Because it's a tilt house. Is it? What's that? Where am I going? Up, upstairs. Now we want to go upstairs, not through the. All right, the layout's it's, it's, it's cool, but less than perfect, because we can't get outside onto the actual porch, which is the whole point of a stilt house, is that you kind of can look out over things. <coughs> Let's see, we can go, can we go around here without going in? Yes. But it's... Oh, come on. How do I get to my backyard? Okay, well, there's at least the stilts, and there are the, there's the the uh, there are the porches. So it is a true stilt house. This looks very similar to the one that Michael dragged to pieces. Uh, let me up. So there's my view. Can I can I do something iffy here? This is either gonna kill me or we're gonna get to that dang porch. We yay! We did it. We made it to the porch. Look at this. And I don't, I don't have curtains drawn in the other one. That should be the door. You can see it's a door. I don't think I can get to the the other one. Let's see. Okay, now ow, 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 ow. So I can't get to the lower the lower uh, porch. All right, Rockstar, come on. That this is a this is a Rockstar, come on. <sighs> All right, so that's my tour of my new Hoovy house here. We're going to keep those cards. It's freed me up a bunch of space. And we're going to do more of that very shortly. And on that note, this is your Black Knight. Have a great night.